Hi, I'm Renee Olstead, and this is Ella Fitzgerald, and we're here for PETA 2. Well, Ella Fitzgerald and I first met uh, at an animal shelter, and when you rescue a dog, they know it, and they never forget it, and there's a loyalty and a bond that you're going to have with your dog that you won't get anywhere else. I was on a sitcom when I was about 12, and they had this one line where one of the characters was vegetarian, and she said, no thanks, I don't eat anything with a face, and I just turned white. And from that moment, I suddenly realized that what I was eating was alive and had a mother and breathed, and it suddenly became so appalling. If you're thinking about going vegetarian, don't worry about it, it's not a huge thing to take on. Take it step by step. I actually really, really used the PETA2 website when I was going vegan. I really liked it because you had these lists that you could print out and I used to keep them in my purse. It's not being radical. We're just wanting a humane way for these animals to die so they don't have to go through the torture of, of a slow and unpleasant death. If you do not want to dissect a frog, if you don't want to dissect a pig, speak up. You don't have to. There's a lot of different alternatives. Make sure that you go the extra mile to score extra well on that test and prove that teacher wrong. I would say that a cause that I'm particularly passionate about would be dog fighting. The idea that my dog could have ended up in, in a place like the Michael Vick situation, it kills me I, to think about the things that happened to my dog and the things that I've seen and the way that she behaves when she gets scared. It, it makes me so sad and I can't imagine anybody that would be able to hurt an animal or want to make that happen. It, it's so appalling and it needs to be stopped. And if you know anybody who does it or is aware of it, please encourage them to come forward with what they know or please report them because you're gonna save so many lives and there's just so much pain and suffering that you just can't even understand until you see the pictures. If you want to get involved with animal rights, one of the easiest things that you can do is encourage your friends and loved ones to eat vegetarian meals with you. If you start transitioning them, they can see why you made the choice.